everyone, and welcome to the Pumpkin Patch. I'm the Beastly Pumpkin, and today we'll be going over the top 5 cryptids that have been seen in Alaska. Number 5. Alaska is a very enormous state. With 663,000 square miles, it's about the size of Germany, Poland, and France combined. Alaska's population is around 737,000 people. Plenty of these people have claimed to seen some of the strangest monsters ever heard of. One of these creatures that people have claimed to seen are the legendary woolly mammoths from a bygone era. There have been many reports from all the way back to 1896, all the way up to modern day. There was also an account published in Maine about a story of a journalist who went out to Alaska to purchase some ivory of the legendary woolly mammoth for scientific reasons. He went out to a tribe who have claimed to have had tusks from the legendary creature. Upon arriving, the journalist thought that they would have found fossils of the creature. Upon examining the tusks, he noticed there was still blood and fur on the creature's tusks. When he asked the tribe how they got it and where the blood came from, the tribe said that they killed two of them just over three weeks ago, and they said that there is a large group, or a herd, of woolly mammoths living above a river just north of their town. The tribe claimed that they were out on a routine hunt when these large creatures started to come towards them. The ground started to shake, and they heard shrill-like trumpets throughout the air. The creatures charged them, and they happened to kill two of them before the rest of the herd scrambled off. After this, the reporter talked to the governor of Alaska. He said that if woolly mammoths were still alive in Alaska, Alaska would be the place to do it. Plenty of land and great weather for it. Number 4. The Illamana Lake Monster In a sparsely populated area of southwest Alaska, with only 109 residents, lies the 1,012 square mile Illamana Lake. This lake is home to plenty of fish such as salmon, trout, and northern pike. The lake itself is 77 miles long and 22 miles wide and 988 feet deep. It is the largest lake in Alaska. The monster known as Gonekadek by the Tlingit people were reviewed as a god. The natives claimed this creature had the body of an orca and the head of a wolf, and was known to eat fishing boats. Early Russian explorers reportedly saw the creature, and sightings of the creature have continued all the way to this day. Modern reports come from explorers and biologists who have seen 30-foot monsters sometimes described as aluminum-covered, and other times black with white stripes coming out of the water. One report is from an airplane snagging the beast with a tuna hook. The beast towed the plane around the lake before those aboard decided to release the hook. There were also multiple sightings in June 2017. On June 19th, many people from the local town said they saw something emerge from the lake. They said there was more than one. There was at least three of them. The first one was double in size and over 32 feet long. They said they were black or very dark gray and they were at a total loss of words of what they were seeing. Experts have claimed that the Illamana Lake Monster is everything from a white sturgeon, to a sleeper shark, to a beluga whale. But all of those creatures reach a length of about 20 feet. And eyewitnesses say that the creatures that they've seen are much bigger than that. Number 3. Kodiak Island lies just 176 miles from Illamana Lake and is the scene of another sighting for a water monster. In 1969, a shrimp boat by the name of Mylark, equipped with state-of-the-art sonar equipment and coasted just off the shore of Kodiak Island. They were attempting to map out the sea floor. Their equipment detected an object swimming about 330 feet below the Mylark. The largest living creature, the blue whale, only reaches 100 feet in length, and the creature that they saw was double in size. The crew of the ship said they saw a creature with two pairs of flippers, a long slender tail, and a long thin neck, topped with a small square head. 
The crew of the ship told journalists and townspeople that they thought they had saw a dinosaur, and that that was the best description they could have given. Number 2 In 2002, hundreds of Alaskans told the Anchorage Daily News that they had seen gigantic birds. These gigantic birds flew over towns, villages, and native villages as well. Every report was saying that the birds were much bigger than anything they had seen before. One report, a man was working on his tractor when he saw a bird, and he couldn't believe it. At first he thought it was a plane, one of the old-timey planes. Then he saw the creature bank left, and he noticed it wasn't a plane. His first thought was if you had any children outside, they most certainly would have been taken. All the other reports of these giant birds claimed that they just flew over, scouting the area, and then they flew back into the woods. All of these reports were brought to scientists, and the scientists said they are certainly not aware of any giant birds, that birds that big went extinct hundreds of years ago, as far as we know. Number one. For this last creature, it's certainly one of the most strange. The Kushtaka, or Land Otter People. The Land Otter People of Southern Alaska have terrorized a small native tribe for centuries. A story was put out about these creatures in the Alpines magazine, claiming that the Kushta are a race of people who can shapeshift into otters. It also referred to them as were-otters. Very similar to a werewolf, but very less frightening. The story goes that the Kushka assume the form of an otter and lure humans into their trap. And when they do, they turn them into Kushka as well. Once a human becomes a Kushka, his position in the afterlife is forfeit, and his soul is trapped here on Earth forever, in the form of an otter. The tribe of Tlingit claim that these creatures are real. The tribe itself believes that these creatures are so real that they have actually become to fear some otters. Whether this creature is real or not, that's up for you to decide. Thank you all for watching.